I'm Vancouver Sun columnist Daphne Bramham. Wow, who wouldn't want to come here? That's what Canadian tourism officials are hoping people will say when they see what this country has to offer. National, provincial, regional and local tourism officials are all treating the 2010 Winter Olympics as the biggest single ad buy in Canadian history. As the lead agency selling Canada overseas, the Canadian Tourism Commission has had its budget boosted. It's refined its message to leverage the Games, and it's using a new strategy to sell Canada. It's been inviting select media to come here. It's sponsoring key athletes and their families to experience the country by staying with a Canadian family. And it's using the internet and social media as well. Over the past two years, the CTC has been gathering video and still photos like this, and it's offering the images free to media around the world. It's way beyond the stereotype of Moose Mountains and Mounties. That's because research indicates people already know Canada is beautiful. To get them to come here, marketers need to sell them more than empty spaces. They need to sell them excitement and adventure, but they also need to sell urban experiences that include first-class accommodations, spas, and great dining. To do that, CTC has not only posted video and still images on its website, it's created full stories with audio, video, and print components. There's one about the Surf Sisters in Tofino. There's another about a First Nations village, and there's one about dog sledding. Already those images and stories have been seen by millions of viewers in the United States, Germany, Japan, and South Korea. In a place like India, the Winter Games doesn't get much attention. India's never won an Olympic gold medal on snow or ice, and it's only expected to send one athlete this year, a loser. But India's one of Canada's key tourism markets, so the CTC convinced Vanock to let Bollywood megastar and heartthrob Aske Kumar be a torchbearer. It was front page news in India when it was announced. Canada can't buy that kind of publicity. Canada in the Olympics will be on every newspaper in India and every television station again in mid-December after Kumar runs in Toronto. To make it easy for the Indian media, video and still images of his run will be posted on the CTC's website. The kind of buzz that the CTC has generated in India with the torch relay is a harbinger of the massive interest tourist marketers expect the 2010 Winter Olympics will create among 3 billion visitors who are going to tune in at games time. With the exposure from the Olympics, Canada's goal is to increase tourism revenues by 30% in the five years following the games. BC's goal is equally ambitious. The message that tourism officials want people to get is simple. Don't wait. Come to Canada now and be prepared to jump into an adventure of a lifetime.